Hi YouTube, it's me again, Taylor the Engine. Today, I really made out like a bandit. What I have today that I found at Habitat Restore in Urbana, Illinois, is this oddity right here. It's a 20 inch SNR box fan. And it looks to be, you know, from like the 1960s or early 70s, late 60s. One thing I really find unique about this fan is it's got the three plastic blades in it. I have never really seen that very well. I've always seen the box fans with the three metal blades or the five or six or seven plastic blades. This one is truly an oddity. And let's take a look at it, you know. Really am impressed with the condition of this van. It's in pristine condition. There is literally no rust on it whatsoever. None. Absolutely none. Zip. Zilch. Nada. I don't know how common or rare these fans are, but there is nothing broken or missing off this fan. The handle is actually in the best condition. I mean, let's take a look at the SNR badge on it. Ain't that pretty? So, I really like the color too. It's like a lime green color ish, if you will. Um, I do want to point something out though. The motor, I don't know what kind of motor that is. I'd have to ask either. Tori the fan man or Bo Mitchell Because Bo Mitchell has a Lasco version of this one and it's really nice. Go check him out. It's Bo Mitchell He's got a lot of cool fan videos and stuff And one of my other favorites is Emerson Collie All right, this truly is What a real box fan is made of folks to a 360 of this fan so y'all can see the fan. There's the side of the fan. Not a single scratch, ding, or anything on the cabinet. The, the covers are slightly warped a little bit, just a little bit though. But nothing a little, a heat gun or some hot steam won't be able to mold it back into the straight form. There's the back of the fan in all its vintage glory. Yes, Esky Wolf, it's got the handle. I didn't really think I would find one with the handle. I am one lucky motherfucker. Anyway. And it is on high. Here's the load. It does shake a lot. I'm pretty sure I can, there's a few kinks I can work out of this thing. It's no big deal. I mean, it sure is better than today's garbage. I'll tell you that. It sure blows those little lascos out of the water. Off. 
check out Tori the Fan Man too. He's got some pretty cool videos too. The coasting time on this thing is pretty good too. I put oil in this thing because you know the oil stinks. What I like to do is I run it on high outside for about 10 or 20 minutes until the smell is gone and then I spray like deodorant, Iser spray in there or whatever. Anyway, that does it for this video. Thank you for watching. You guys rock. Keep on rocking until there ain't no beat left. Peace.